getting the idea, the meaning behind the telling of Custer's Alive books. So, to get the full meaning, I set up this system for this particular track. In general, I would do a normal track without a system, but on this one I am going to, and I hope you don't mind. So what do you say? Let's get started, shall we? I think the main reason why I made this story is because it was inspired by a good friend of mine named Jaden Johnson, in which he helped me write the book as well. We did have plans to write the second, third, and fourth one together, but I took it upon my decision to write the rest of the books myself. And it was also my idea to make the book series into a tetralogy, mainly because it would end the book the way it should be ended, if you know what I mean. Getting the idea, the meaning behind the telling of Custer's Alive books. In order to grasp the full concept behind the telling of these stories, I would like you to focus on the objectives that this story has announced. For instance, if you take a look at the beginning of the story, on every book in the series, as close to reference as possible, you could almost imagine what every book has to offer. I mean, who wouldn't imagine? Okay, here we go with two major targets. This talks about the story in a very unique way as it is brief and simple and it keeps to the point. Alright, so first off, a special thanks for choosing my book. I hope you enjoy it. Second off, this book was made not to scare the reader or change the facts about Custer, South Dakota. In fact, this story has a fictional basis as in having historical fiction as its main genre. That means every book in the series has that sort of realm feature to it. Getting the idea, the meaning behind the telling of Custer's Alive books. I think the main reason why we started this series is because we were camping buddies great co-authors in the process, and we collaborated on highlighted ideas for what would be the story as a whole. And besides, to even point out those unique elements is what brought the story to life. Skipping further ahead, book two. When writing book two, I think what pushed me to write it was not only trying my best, but having fun seeing how many pages I could write. The first book took two years to write. The second book took only a couple of months to write, while the third one is unknown, but I'm guessing I wrote it shortly after the second book was written. So yeah, one day it will be finished. It will get done. That's pretty much all I have to say. But if you really want to know the meaning, perhaps your best bet is understanding the first book, the second book, and so forth. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching and listening. Take care.